Assalamu alaikum, my name is Nassim Lashav and we are here at PQ Skate Park to pick up some cars from this Bronson deck. Yeah. We got the homies hyping it up, Cookie brought some sweets to the session and all the Mafia boys are here. Fuck yeah. First photo in a skateboard magazine. Dude, this is so funny. The homie just like, he was scrolling down this old mags he had, and he found this mag that I had like my first picture on it. It's like a sugar skate mag, but I was still living in Morocco. Never left Morocco, I was 16 years old. And I was like a backflip on this outledge with Hassan Two Tower behind, you know. I was so stoked because never made it out of uh, Morocco back then, and yeah. I don't know, never thought I would have a photo on the mag. Is that like a European mag? Yeah, it still exists, Sugar Skate mag. Sugar skate they have like mag. this section called uh, Vogel for like new upcoming people and shit like that. I was like yeah. 16, so I, the homie Yassin Jalal took the photo, photographer from Morocco. Oh, yeah. Did that like light a fire to like get a photo in a magazine? So much, man, insane, yeah. for real. But I told the homie, keep that mag, because I didn't have it, you know? The homie just randomly, like literally, like three days ago or so. Damn. I was like, keep it for me, and I'm coming to Morocco to grab it for sure. <laughs> That's so sick. What is your go-to skate video to get hyped? Stay gold, I think, since forever. Oh, for days. Yay. Yeah. yeah. Shout out John Miner. Stay gold, timeless. Love the Kevin Spanky intro too. Like the, just the thingy on his face and the fucking tears coming down. It's perfect. <laughs> so good. I know. If you found a hundred dollar bill, what would you buy? Food. <laughs> Food. So we're talking personal pan pizza or like for the crew? Well, for the crew, for sure. If I'm out and skating in a session, sick. Fucking straight up. <laughs> Favorite street skater? He's right there. Look at him. <laughs> Since you mentioned Stay Gold, let's see a frontside flip switch Manny for the boss. Oh, I don't know if I can do that. Best seat in the van. Best seat in the van? Window back. Why? You're close to the window if you want to smoke, can sleep, and you don't have the duties for the co-driver. <laughs> Headphones at the skate park or not? Nah. When I hear the homies, talk to the homies, hear my board, yeah. hear the sound of the grind, live yeah. the moment. Yeah, live it in the moment, right? Exactly. Right. Yeah, music is for under the shower, you're driving in a car, maybe a speaker, let everyone like fucking enjoy the music, not by yourself. I sure. love that about you. First professional skateboarder you've seen with your own eyes. I don't know if he was pro back then, but uh, Mathieu Dupuis. And uh, I've seen Doobie as well, one of the first like skate trips I've seen. It was a double skateboard, this French brand that came to Morocco for a skate yeah. trip. Like, yeah, it was my first year skating, I was 12 years old. It was like the first foreigner skaters like outside of Morocco that I've seen skating, you know. Like, I don't know, they had like yeah. good level, they had like good boards, good shoes, you know. We were like fucking struggling back then in Morocco. It was like, yeah. we were amazed. How, how did that make you feel, like seeing a professional skateboarder in person? Yeah, I was like, yeah. wow, I wanna like fucking, I don't know, skate that spot with them and I don't know, yeah. get experience from them. They were speaking French and we were speaking French back in Morocco too. So it was just like yeah. practice the language as well. Get to know like how is it out there because we never came out of Morocco back then, you know. So. And then when I turned 15, they started hooking me up with boards because they came back to Morocco met them again and they start hooking me up with boards and stuff. But then like I was riding for them properly for like a year and a half or two, living in Morocco. So they sold their boards in Morocco at some point. Do you think that moment in time helped 
bring you to where you are today? Yeah, a thousand percent. Yeah. Every time I would skate with any skate team or skate crew that would come from outside of Morocco, for all of us in general in Morocco, it felt like what you see in the videos and shit, you know, like yeah. you would never expect to see that in real life. And for them to come to Morocco as well, we're like, what the fuck are they coming to do here, you know? Yeah, Looking yeah. back at it now, it's like fucking so many good spots. This is one of the best skate destinations ever for sure. Well, now you know they're coming to see you. <laughs> <laughs> First concert, last concert, rap, punk, rock, indie rock. One of my first concerts that I would remember good, it was the Deep Purple. They came to Morocco during this uh, festival called Mawazin. And the last concert, you know the homie Danny Jenks in Barcelona? His dad used to play for Buena Vista Social Club, fucking famous as uh, yeah, yeah. band, you know? The three other guys that played for that band, they did a concert in Barcelona. And uh, Danny told me about it and I went to watch it straight out. That band is sick, it's just so good. <laughs> Would you be willing to play a game of state with Wes Kramer? Ooh. Why not? <laughs> you would join? I'll join. Let's see yeah. that. Wesley, Chuck. Hey, Chuck. You've been summoned for a game of skate. Game of skate? Yeah. Uh, Chuck, for sure. I'll it. forfeit. Yeah. Go easy. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. Hey. Oh my god! I forfeit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out of the game of skate already. <laughs> Black Sabbath, Nasl Riwan, and uh, Iron Maiden, I'd say, maybe. Kick flips or heel flips? Kick flips, because I can't heel flip that good, but I'm working on them though, I'm working on them. What language do you speak? I speak five languages. The spoken language in Morocco is called Darija. It's a slang, it's a mix between the Berber, native language from North Africans, Arabic, and French, and Spanish. And there are like some words that doesn't exist in any language. They're just like Darija, you know, it's like a slang. And then we have Arabic as second language and the French as well. We can understand Arab people, but Arab people can't understand us, you know? Like we have a bunch of words that are not Arabic, but like we have Arabic as second language kind of, so we can like, we already can understand Arabic, you know? I lived in Spain for three years. I learned Spanish super quick because like, Moroccan has already a bunch like fucking of words in Spanish yeah. and stuff, you know? The north part of Morocco actually like speak more Spanish than French as second language. Because like that was the part that was colonized by the Spanish, and then the rest of Morocco was colonized by the French, so that's why like French is our second language. And I bet you didn't know that. Skate parks, three spots, all day. <laughs> What's the sickest Morocco spot? White spot, baby. <laughs> yeah. Favorite spot, favorite crew. It's like a round plaza, so you can like just keep pushing around, never stopping. Yeah. And it's all marble. And in the middle of the round, there's like a lot of other rounds, so you can go like manis, skate ledges, pop over, you can like gap from one to another one. I was like super close from my house. That's why I skate a lot of manis, and you know. <laughs> if you could plan a skate trip, who and where? Dude, I've been trying to plan this trip to Morocco with the Croc Creek boys so bad. It would be sick like, to just take the whole crew and go there together. Well, Favorite know. Motorhead song? God Was Never By Your Side. <laughs> Good, not Ace of Spades. Nice. <laughs> Fastest skateboarder? I'd say Milton. He's got that shit. Best skate trip you've been on? The trip I did to Iran with Red Bull, that's fucking unforgettable. It's just like the shit I got to see there and I don't know. It was super sick. It's like one of the places that I would never ever think about going to, you know, yeah. skateboarding took me years. It's like one of the trips that I would fucking remember forever. Biggest purchase so far. Happiness doesn't have a price. <laughs> Of the grail. Yeah. 
Hey Nassim, which Bronson sparing do you skate and why? I skate Bronson Row because they're the fucking fastest. 